what is up what is up what is up fs club happy easter guys we got mods new mods on easter sunday at 4 a.m in the morning my time wow i know i am late that is because of course i am not up at 4 a.m to do a video but anyways let's get to these new mods remember these mods are on all platforms it is the cody tab 26 the Canerland CLC Evo, the John Deere 6M series, the Dangerville ETB 15,000, the Brochured EV 2200, the Lizard Orm 190, the Holopack, and then we also got an update to the John Deere 90 skid steer loader from Black Sheep Money. Okay, let's get into these mods, guys. Okay, the first one. This is the Cody Tav 26. 11 slots, $55,000. It holds up to 26,000 liters. Really nice. I like those license plates. See, it says tab 26 on it. So pretty nice right here. Let's take a look at it in store. Okay, let's go over here. Let's go into slurry tanks. All the way at the very end, there it is right there. It does require 180 horsepower. Uh, I think this is actually manure, uh, manure system ready for PC, I believe. Uh, if you guys know, let me know in the comment section below. Okay, main colors, you got your greens, blue, yellow, and black design. Uh, you either have black or red. Wheel brand, Trailborg, Michelin, or Lizard. You can't change the wheel setup on that. Uh, design, you either have color or white. Uh, fenders, you have plastic or metal. So there is the Cody Tab 26. Okay, next one. This is always the fun name to pronounce. This is the Cavernerland CLC Evo. Nine slots, $26,000. And guess what, guys? It is not a three meter plow. It is a four meter plow. Uh, still pretty nice, though. I like I liked the gold plates right there. Oh. Uh, yeah, pretty nice. Where you can find these ones at? Let's go over here. Let's go under cultivators all the way at the very end. It does require 160 horsepower. Uh, let's see, the only options on that is the design. You have the ActiFlex or the ActiPack. Pretty nice stuff. Okay, next one is the big one. This is the John Deere 6M series. 40 slots, yes guys, it is high in slots, but there's a lot of options on this. Uh, let's see, it is $130,500. As you guys can see, the windows all open, this uh, both windows and the back one. And if you go in, let's put this thing. Hold on, let's actually. As you guys can see, the wheel comes down. Uh, if you do, I think it's LB and RB. And yeah, see, look, you can actually put down the sunshade. <laughs> I know it's something little, but it's still pretty nice nonetheless. Let's turn that engine on. So really nice on that one. I made sure all the lights work. Yep. Turn signals all work. So everything looks like it works. As you guys can see, it is a medium tractor. You can also put a front loader on it. So that's a plus. Uh, we don't really get many uh, medium modded tractors for John Deere. So that is something that is nice. Gets up to 32 miles an hour pretty fast. See, there it is right there. Now let's go ahead and park it. Try not to hit anything. Okay, where you can find this tractor. Let's go over here. Let's go under medium tractors all the way at the very end. There it is right there, the 6M series six cylinder. 164 horsepower is the base on it. Rim colors, you got your yellows, you got grays, black, beiges, and orange. Design pretty much the same thing. And main color, I believe it's the same thing. Yes, the same thing on that one. Configurations, you have standard, 360 uh, front weights, 560, 760, 10,000, I mean 1,000, not 10,000, 1,010. And then you got the front hydraulic. And then, of course, you have the standard. Wheel burn, you have Trailborg, Michelin, Midas, uh, or Nakian. Trailborg, you have standard, wheel weights, wide tires, wide tires plus weights, rear twin wheels, twin wheels, and back to standard. I believe it's the same for all of them. Yes, same for all of them. Design, you have standard or tinted windows, or Starfire, or Starfire plus tinted windows. So pretty nice. Uh, you have the engine setup, the 6155, which is 164. The 6175, which is 185. The 6195M, which is 206. So I'm going all the way up to 206. And you can also put a front loader on it. So pretty nice. I think that is it on that one. Yes. Okay, so that is the John Deere. Really nice tractor. Next one. This is the Dangerville ETB 15,000. 13 slots, $38,600. Holds up to 22,000 liters. Really nice manure spreader. I don't know why it actually reset it all the way to that end facing that way don't know why look at that it even has like telephone numbers on there i don't i don't know if that's a real number but anyways uh, also has email sites wow okay so there is that one let's go in the back real quick so there is the back 
course, when you unfold it, that thing comes out. So it even has working lights right back there. Okay, so where you can find this one, let's go over to manure spreaders. All the way to the end, there it is right there. It does require 200 horsepower, it has a 15 meter spread on it, and there is no options on that one. Okay, next one is another manure spreader. This is the brochured EV2270. Six slots, $65,000. It holds up to 23,100 20, 23, liters. And this is another nice manure spreader right here. Of course, that thing lifts and of course it spreads. So yeah, these ones are both nice. Wow. Where you can find this one, let's go under manure spreaders. And there it is right there. It does require 150 horsepower. Uh, let's see, there is options on this one though. Main color, you got any color you want. Same thing with design and rim. Uh, wheel bearing, you have Trailborg, Michelin. Trailborg, you have standard or wide tires. And Michelin, you have standard or wide tires. So there is that one right there. The last regular mod for the day, guys. This is the Lizard Orm 190. Five slots, $29,600. It holds up to 21,000 liters. Pretty nice little trailer right here, though. I have to say. Pretty nice. I know it's a Lizard brand, but yeah. There's that one right there, and then we got the extended one right over there. Where you can find these ones, let's go under trailers, all the way to the very end. There it is right there. It can hold pretty much any kind of crop you could think of. Uh, you have capacity is 19,000, 20,000, 21,000. Uh, you have Wilburn, Michelin, or Trailborg. So there is the regular mods for today. Really, really nice. Okay. Next one, the last mod for today. Let's go over here. Come on, run, run, run. We have the Holla Pack. Two slots. Uh, they range from 5,420 all the way up to 6,200. And of course, these are sheds, and that bird was like sideways there for a second. But, anyways, uh, nice little vehicle shelters. We got this one, and then we got one with like a brick right there. So, pretty nice right there. Where you can find these, let's go into placeables, sheds, and there they are right. Nope, that's not it. There they are right there, and 360 degree rotation on that one, and another 360 degree rotation on that one. So, pretty nice little surprise today whenever I thought we weren't going to get no new mods. So, yes. Uh, so, I think my favorite one for today is probably the manure spreaders and the John Deere's. Let me know in the comment section below which one was your guys' favorite. Okay, so remember, today guys, there will be two more videos. There will be a construction simulator one, and there will also be the new mod and map video. So. Since this is the first video, I'd like to say a big old happy Easter to everybody, from my family to you guys. And yeah, so if you guys did like the video, make sure you guys do pound that like button. If you haven't subbed, make sure you guys do. And like always, have an awesome day, farmers. Peace.